June 16, 2019, with Jesse and Dylan regarding the sacrament of ganja in Madison, Wisconsin, and their rights to be able to distribute it. And we got the brethren here today, and Jesse want to bring forward some words. Yeah, bless the love, everybody. Uh, June 16th, give thanks for uh, Brother Tupac for June 16th. Give a shout out. And uh, what we want to get on to, though, is uh, a more pressing matter that we're dealing with. So I'm going to bring uh, everybody to light to this article that you may have seen or not. But it's, a, it's an old article from, uh, this is coming from A.C. Cummings. Uh, this is coming from, let's see, uh, the Evening Citizens London News Bureau, copyrighted by Southam Publishing Company. Now, this is back in um, around, you know, quite a while ago, almost 100 years ago. Um, it says, London, April 30th, a moving appeal to the peoples of the world has been given by Emperor Haile Selassie to the Times correspondent at Addis Ababa. To the people of the world not yet realized, asked the Emperor, that by fighting on to the bitter end, I'm not only performing my sacred duty to my people by standing guard in the last citadel of collective security, are they too blind to see that I have my responsibilities to the whole of humanity to face? I must still hold on till my tardy allies appear, and if they never come, I say prophetically and without bitterness, the West will perish. And this is a, a quote from His Imperial Majesty, and we find that even now, this is relevant, we're dealing with the same issues of collective security. If you don't know that word, it's, a, it's a very important. The, the League of Nations and the United Nations were all formed on collective security, which His Imperial Majesty uh, introduced them to in, in a pure form of, of, a, of, a, of law. In, uh, in language and a covenant. So these are the same issues that we're dealing with, this collective security. So that brings us to the point that now here we are um, coming forth. We have a court date coming up. We have a couple court dates coming up, but one of them is uh, the next one for apparently is around uh, June 19th at around 10 in the morning in uh, the Madison Dane County Courthouse here in Wisconsin. So we have a hearing coming up and it's real important that people realize what time it is that we're on the forefront here. Uh, the, the lock has been picked and broken, and, and the locks broke off. The seals are busted. So now what's important is that uh, the, the tardy allies appear. So now here we are putting the word out once again in the name of Sir Your Majesty Haile Selassie the first, uh, waiting for our tardy allies to appear. And we, we hope and we, we wish that if any uh, brother or sister is out there and is able to come forward to uh, come show support, uh, on June 19th, that's in a few days from now, come show support and let them know what Rastafari is about and that we have a large group of people that uh, are good people, clean people, and our issues are important. So if, uh, if anybody is of the mind and ability, uh, we wish for you to come support us. And I know uh, that this is a very big issue for a lot of people bigger than us. So if, uh, if you have time, please come make it. Yes, uh, I'm, I'm in a group, totally agreement of that. Rastafari, Nazarite, those who understand uh, the meaning of the use of the sacrament, Ganja, Kali Weed, Kali Bud, uh, for the Rastafari, should come forward. And I'm speaking particularly to those in the United States of America because a friend nearby is greater than a friend far, far off. So we respect the brethren in Yard, you know, Barbados and Ethiopia as a, as a whole. Uh, you know, and throughout, you know, the African continent. But we stand here in the States, Milwaukee, uh, Madison, Wisconsin, and, you know, we just got to be able to come forward. This issue is bigger. This is an international issue. This is, uh, you see us on the international, the national, the international news. So this issue, we have Rastafari at the forefront of a, of, of a big thing going on uh, regarding law and regarding uh, the future Regarding law and, and religious liberty, religious rights, and, and cannabis, and our own culture, our identity as Rastafari. So if you see that as an opportunity that we have with the stage, come forward now. We have, we're giving everybody an invitation. Come forward. Uh, this is not just for us to sit here and then bring our mouth out all the time. Come forward with your ideas. Come support Rastafari. Come show the works and come step up because uh, the door is open and we're holding up the pillar and we, we require other people come. It's time to come forward now. If you about something, if you about anything, come now. Yes, Now's sir. the time. Yes, sir. That's true. Dylan, you want to hit them up with anything? Yeah, we appreciate all the report or all the uh, support that we received 
thus far. A lot of people been coming out, giving support, showing support in different ways, building links. We ask that more people will come out far and wide. If you see us, if you support Rastafari, you support the Lion of Judah, then come out and show that support. We give thanks for everything that we receive day into day and night into night. Everybody, we ask that we hold the faith and stand firm in Babylon. Rastafari. You know, I mean, your brother, you're speaking on the shop. You're speaking on the house of Judah there in Madison. And you, what, 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 are, what are we doing there? What are, what are we doing there? Yeah, right now uh, we got a lot of things we're trying to put forth. We got the shop is uh, back. Some brothers came over there and helped us clean it out. It was totally destroyed. A lot of uh, books and everything were destroyed too. And uh, flags were ripped down and damaged and things like that. So they, uh, they're showing no respect. And that's something that you need to think about. This is something uh, at the last court hearing, um, I had told them that I require a translator, which is important. We got a language and other people have their own private society. So they already respect that we have our own private society by the, the appearance of uh, the clergy or the priest or the religious person. So now there's bigger issues that we can open up. So some of these things are like our language. Uh, His Imperial Majesty said that language is the key to culture. So how can we how can we understand a Babylon legalese language? We don't understand those languages. And the only thing we understand is our only language is our, is our own identity, Rastafari language. That's that's what's natural to us. So that uh, other people have. An interpreter that they are provided in the same way we require the same as everybody else without a, a preference to one religion or one society over another we have our language so these things are real check it out on Encyclopedia Britannica to be confirmed for uh, for your own self to see more about it but so Naya, the language. Naya Bingy should show up though you know come bring the drums yeah Naya Bingy songs. should show up and you know those who know the language other Rastafari support the brother and Jesse and Dylan, you know, in the Madison, Wisconsin court. Yes, we do our yes, we do our reggae yes. shows, we're doing a whole lot of numbers. But this is the real number. And again, I'm Halo here in Milwaukee and I just I'm my support is for the brethren. I want yes. you wherever this video reach to support the brethren, not just in email, not just in word. Boots on the ground. Boots on the ground. Come show up. Come reason with us. Come come work and come put in works, come open up a church. What's the address again? It's at 555 West Mifflin Street, Madison, Wisconsin. Uh, call and come in from anywhere. Come over here and help us build this thing out because we have the church, yes. we have the doors open, we have the stage. It's an international and a national stage. So come up here, help us put this word out. Yes. So you like low on batteries, is that it? No, I think that's it. Okay. Right, right, yeah. Well, that's not it. We got, we got the rich point out. Yeah, we, we hit them up.